I do have a lot of questions for you, actually. Your life is very interesting. <laughs> How long have you taken over your dad's farm? Uh, so we're still in the transition of him leaving, <laughs> but, but I've been running it myself for uh, two or three years now, but I've been here full time for about 12 or 13. Have you been helping since you were young? Yeah, since I can remember. And it was, you wanted, you wanted it, right? The first few years I wasn't sure on what I wanted to do, but uh, somewhere around 17, 18 is when I decided this is where I wanted to be for sure. I admire that a lot. I don't think I, I personally ever wanted my family's farm, ever. <laughs> I still don't, I'm still not ready for that, but I find that very admirable. What, what does a family farm mean to you? So in, in our exact business, the family farm is, is, it's my family doing the work. We take our kids to the barn. Um, on, on a weekend, they're around helping with the Ken, with the Ken at their age. Um, me and my wife run it, my dad's around to help when uh, help's needed and all my other producers, it's them and their wives and their children also. So it's, it's a very small group of people that get all the work done together. Do you think your vision when you were a 17 year old for the, for the farm changed versus now actually being in the transition of requiring the farm? In my younger years, I always wanted to be the biggest okay. and in today's world, I want to be the best. Yeah, more quality than quantity. Yes, exactly. Wonderful. In, in today's world being the best, that's the only vision that our business as a whole has. We embrace the new CP program as one of the first ones in the country to do it. And uh, getting all of our sites registered has been a big undertaking, but has been the best for our business. Keeping all of our producers held to the highest standards in, the, in Canada has been a goal of ours. Do you think it's a bigger challenge for family farms to adhere and adjust to this new program? In Ontario specifically, most of our farms are family farms and we, it's hard to spend the time in the office when you want to be in the barn taking care of your livestock. That's true. That must be, that must be a new challenge for, for all farmers now. Yeah. As, a, as a chef that's learning and growing still, I, I used to have, a th I used to think that as long as the farm is big, and, and growing rapidly, it, it doesn't count as a family farm. What are your thoughts about that? So family farms have grown in the past and they're still family farms today. Some are bigger, some are smaller. The more generations, the more children into a family, the bigger the operations have become. Farms grow because families have grown. The more siblings that there is, is the more work that can get done at the end of the day, is the more animals they can have at the end of the year.